And here comes one of my favorites. The following contest is a fatal four-way extreme rules match and is for the ECW World Heavyweight Championship. Making his way to the ring from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 268 pounds, Ryan O. Here we go, guys. We're going to finally have a champion after this one. And you have to imagine these superstars are feeling the pressure here. You don't come into a match of this magnitude without feeling it at least a little bit. Things are about to get good. And his opponents first. From Louisville, Kentucky, weighing in at 279 pounds, Ian Robbins! Ladies and gentlemen, this match is for the vacant championship, which means tonight we finally crown one of these superstars as our next champion. And it's about time, if you ask me. And guys, you have to respect how much pride he has in what he does. I don't know, Michael. I understand the importance of having pride in what you do, but sometimes I think he can be a bit overbearing. I don't know if he means to be, but that's definitely how he comes across at times. Oh yeah, I am pumped for this guy. And from Houston, Texas, weighing in at 232 pounds, Mosca! Guys, we finally crown a new champion here tonight. That's right, the title's been vacant for long enough. One of these superstars will be going home tonight as the new champion. I'd say that he's among the most prideful superstars on the roster today. Well, when you accomplish what he's been able to accomplish, Michael, you have every right to be proud of yourself. And here he comes. Here we go, guys. We're finally going to crown a new champion here tonight. Cole, this match right here is the absolute definition of history-making. Whoever wins this will forever have their name in WWE history books, and that's really saying something. And I'd also note that he's shown a more aggressive side of late. Nothing wrong with that, Michael. If you sit back and wait for the fight to come to you here in the WWE, you're as good as done. Social media is buzzing, as it always is, when this title is defended.
It's extreme rules, folks, and the action can leave you speechless. Corey, how does a competitor adjust to this brutality? Well, the main thing is to remember that anything you can imagine is within the rules. All is fair in love and war, and that goes for extreme rules, too. What would you know about love, Byron? But anyway, the paper submission has to be in the ring to win. Able to enter. Here's a cover. And he gets his shoulder up before the count. Getting that shoulder up seemed to be pretty easy. Oh, nice nice clothesline. Running knee lift. Corey, what's the sound strategy for going into an Extreme Rules match? That's a tough question, Cole. It's hard to plan for something as chaotic as an Extreme Rules match. But you need to remember that pins and submissions have to happen in the ring. So if you're in trouble, the harsh arena floor could actually be a safe haven. Ooh, take it up the knee. Deliver an attack with intentions of cutting down their base. Oh, God. Close line to the back of the neck. All the way up. The cross landing powerbomb. That powerbomb was absolutely worthy of both halves of its name. Constructing the knee there. And a kick. Hey, we're all getting free tickets to the gun show. Kick to the back. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. Big splash. Oof. Punch. Nasty. Back elbow smash. Nothing fancy. Just unloading knees to the body. You can't get caught in a hailstorm like that if you want to win. Shoulder tackle. Going to back suplex. No. Kick to the spine. Oh, nasty stop to finish it off. Attack to the midsection. Placed into the corner. Nice clothesline. Ooh, merciless looking blow. And that was a precisely measured attack. Hammerlock wrenched in. He's looking to unload on his opponent with that kendo stick. He's getting pushed out into the defensive. He asked for extreme to get extreme. So this can he score the pin? Oh, somehow! Just kicking out at one takes a lot in a match like this. Nice edge chop! My goodness, did you hear that chop? Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Lands face first. Looks like he has the upper hand now. It's obvious to see how focused he is now. He saw it coming, taking advantage. Did you see that? Propelled through the air into the cover. And a kick out. And frustration might be starting to set in. Fire a shot like that to completely immobilize your opponent. Letting his opponent know he can take on the world right now. And now thrown back into the ring. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Uh-oh. Uh-oh is right. Package piled. Oh, man. What's he thinking? Oh, we know what he likes to do out here. This is exactly what's next. Oh, oh. Power bomb. Can he take advantage of this? Stomping down. Clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. 
a guitar is turning this into a Nashville style brawl. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. This is just brute power. Sherman! Just pure dominance. Off the barricade. What's he open to find down there? Pretty sure he's about to treat this stop sign like a green light. He's in a little bit of trouble now. In order to succeed in an extreme rules match, you have to be willing to sacrifice your body a bit, guys. Boom, what impact. Ah, oh, face first off the post. And he gets set back into the ring. Boom! He may get the three count right here! I think so! He kicks out at two. Really had less than a second to stay alive there. Looking to put an end to this. A much needed big move. Right forearm. We are seeing these men leaving it all on the line. No stone being left unturned. Everything the body can give is being brought to the table. He went right into that turnbuckle. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Oh, they're just punishing their opponent now. We only got one. Shot. Here's his window. Will he take advantage? Two count. And the champion is officially crowned. Goes home with the gold tonight. Become a champ like this, he is never going to forget this moment or feeling.